Hello guys, welcome to a new video. In this video I will share some Tomb Raider leftovers facts and easter eggs. Uh, some of them I just found out later and others for some reason I forgot to weigh them. So yeah, basically I finally decided to share these ones with you. The first one is in the unfinished business expansion of Tomb Raider 1. We can see on the wall in Egypt a image of Lara. I thought it was a really cool easter egg. In Tomb Raider 4 we find a dying soldier in a garage very similar to the one we see in a movie named Resorved Dogs. I probably butchered the word. Oh well. In Tomb Raider Underworld in the Croft Manor part, we see Winston opening a secret door in Zip's room. Lara and her two friends talk like they didn't know about it, but in Tomb Raider Legend there is a normal door there, so kinda weird. My apologies, Lady Croft, but I have not tended to the crypt. Why didn't you ever tell us this was down here? Yeah, I wish I still didn't know. You know what? I'll wait up here. In the movie Tomb Raider Cradle of Life, at the beginning, Lara uses a watercraft, or whatever that is called, that is very similar to the one she uses in Tomb Raider 3 in the London levels. In Tomb Raider 1 and 2, the medic packs had a red cross on them, but in the gold edition of Tomb Raider 2, they had to change to green because of the real red cross organization. In Tomb Raider 2, the boat section in Venice was likely inspired by the um, 007 Moonwrecker. The save icon on Tomb Raider Anniversary on the PS2 is the original Lara, which is a nice touch. The sheet code in Tomb Raider 1 was based on the movie The Wizard of Oz. In that cutscene that introduces Lara's home, the fish statue that we see there was borrowed from another game called Blam Machine Head. In Tomb Raider 1, in City of Vilcabamba, you can find a carved face texture that appears in one of Indiana Jones movies. In the movie we can see a crab bike that is a reference to Tomb Raider 3, where you can drive one in the main game and in Lara's home. You can also see in that part a jeep and I wasn't sure if I should mention it or not, uh, because we see Lara using it later, but this could be a reference to the jeep that we use in Tomb Raider 4. And those were all the things that I found out, at least I hope so. I hope I didn't forget any, because sometimes I, I discover notes and I was like, oh, too late. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If this is the first video that you watch about these facts, you will find in my channel more videos. I even have a playlist for that, that is basically just videos with facts for each one of the games, okay? So, in this one was kind of like a mix of everything. I even have one for the movie, so check it out if you haven't done it yet. So, that's all and until next time, bye bye!